I quit my job today. <sighs> I quit my job today. I'm happy, I'm sad, I'm scared, I'm excited, I'm petrified, I'm terrified, I'm so scared. I've been with my company for eight years. It was supposed to be a temporary thing. I went in because my friend worked for HR and she was like, I need X amount of people to come in and interview. And I was like, I'll come in. So I went in and I was hired right away. And I went back to my old job and I gave my two weeks. I don't even think I finished the two weeks with them because I was like, bye. And I ended up getting my certification for the field that I was in. I've never done anything in my life for eight years, twice the length of high school. Oh, I can't believe it's been eight years. I can't believe I quit. I used to envision going in and like flipping my desk over and being like, you all are awful. And that didn't happen. I wrote up a letter and I put it in an envelope and I gave it to my boss and I went into her office and she was so happy for me, which kind of sucks because I've been with the company for eight years. It wasn't like this. I am so sad. What can we do to keep you? We really want you to stay here. You're my best employee. It was like, I'm really happy for you. Bye. I'm going from working for a hospice company and doing like data entry, AKA watching movies and listening to music all day to this new career, it, which is crazy because my whole life I've never really had a career. So this is kind of terrifying for me. Now I'm gonna be an office manager for this company. If you've ever been to like any kind of event that's had like an ambulance and EMT staff just kind of like hanging out in case anything happens, the company that I work for is going to provide that ambulance. It's a new position because they don't have anybody in the office right now. So I'm gonna be- Administrative assistant, office manager, receptionist, front desk, personal assistant. I'm so terrified. I'm going from a job that's like so mindless and it's important, but it's just, it's been a really long time of me doing the same thing over and over and over again. I'm looking forward to something where I'm like gonna leave at the end of the day and be like, I accomplished something. I've made a lot of friends. I've lost a lot of friends. A lot of people had babies and a lot of people got married. A lot of people quit and got fired, got laid off, moved. A lot of things have happened over the last eight years. And with all of that interaction between people, you develop office crushes. Accidentally, can't really help it. But there was one guy in the office Actually, there's several guys in the office, but there was one person in particular. He made me stupid. I literally could not be around him without. <laughs> it's completely innocent. I like, there's, it's just, I love him so much. I'm like, I feel like I'm blushing right now, but I wanted to share the story. <laughs> God, this is so embarrassing. I always tell people the same story about him. I would always see him in passing in the break room, lunch room, and just walking around the office and stuff, and he would always be like, What's up, Wagner? And I'd always be like, hi! And this one day in particular, I am leaving the break room with my coworker, and he is standing outside of the break room with another pharmacist. And I walk, <laughs> and I go to walk past him, and he goes, Hey, Wagner, your hair looks really nice today. And I <laughs> oh God, it's so embarrassing. And I turn to this man and I go, Oh really, you like it? Cause it just been a last night and I died it myself. And you really like it, you really think it's cute? I don't know if I really like it or not yet, but you really like it, it does really look good. <laughs> My coworker had to drag me away from him and she is mortified for me. I'm completely oblivious to everything that just happened. And I hear the pharmacist that he's standing with turn around and go, What the fuck was that? <laughs> oh. Since then, I've been told that I need to like chill out and just be cool, be cool. When we see each other in the elevator, he's like, Hey Wagner. And I'm like, Hey, what's up? <laughs> so when I gave my two week notice today, I went into his office and I was like, Hey, what's going on? How you been? I tell him that I get my two weeks. I'm at the job. We're like having a really nice conversation and stuff. And I'm, you know, I get up to leave and I stand up and I go to walk out the door and he stands up and he's like, No, you gotta give me a hug. <laughs> He gave me his card though. He's like, that's my Blackberry. Keep in touch. Only took me eight years, but I got his number. I uh, forgot to record an outro. So I just wanted to say thank you for watching this video. Give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more videos. And I will see you guys on Tuesday for my next How To Tuesday. Bye.